everyone and welcome back to 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. Of course, we're still playing this game, still wildly confused and lost about what's going on, but still very, very intrigued and interested to see where the story is going to be going as we unlock little tiny pieces of the puzzle um, bit by bit. And I'm absolutely loving the way that this story is unfolding. It's great. Last time with Natsuno, we found out that there's like androids involved. Um, really crazy stuff. BJ, they called BJ Miura. And somehow the year 2065 is taking place after the year 2188. Color me intrigued. Today we're going to go hang out with Nenji Ogata. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Thank you again for watching. <sighs> All right. Nenji Ogata. Let's do his prologue. 1985. I guess when you put it like that, maybe you've got a point. I should slow down and think a little. Still, though. Uh, hey, so... are you even listening? What the hell just happened? What? We mean the hell just happened. So she was uh, going to Shigishima Industries, I think. She wanted, she was trying to get dirt on them and shit. And then she, she met up with him on the train. And now he seems to be confused. So. Shit. The, the train. It just went off the rails and. I didn't know you could sleep standing up. No, this is the same platform as before. What the hell is this? We were in that train car, and then the whole thing got knocked off the line. So, how are we here? Huh? No way we would have walked away from an accident like that. Kisaragi, weren't you on that train too? How do we get back here? You mean the train I'm about to get on? You're about to? <laughs> Why does this start out so confusing? Look, just... I need you to listen to me, okay? Uh, whoa, what are you getting so serious about? I'm saying, I've been on this platform before. Well, duh, this is how you get to school every day. No, I mean, just now. I was here. <sighs> uh, is this like a setup for a joke? No, wait. I remember. It wasn't even my train. I got on the semi express to go after you, Kisaragi. You and I were together the whole time, right? Uh, I think I'd know if we were together. Not what I meant, but okay. You're being weirder than usual. Are you okay, man? I don't think he is. Should have figured you assholes would still be here. Well, look what we got here. Ogata, most punchable face in the city. Hey, you leave him alone. You guys need some new material. The hell are you trying to say to me? Wajima. Hey, time we settled our shit. <sighs> we already did. I beat your ass into the ground. I guess that didn't count either. What crawled up your ass anyway? Heard you were talking shit on the Kurihai gang. Saying all we got is strength in numbers. News to me. No more running. We settle this right here, right now. My pompadour is cooler than yours. Yours looks like a limp dick. <laughs> Doesn't it? <laughs> oh no, it does! No more running. We settle this right here, right now. 
Nope. Hey, hold on. What the heck's going on? Cut that out. Relax. I'm not gonna do the same fight twice. I don't have time for that shit anyway. Ain't nobody got time for that. We got here. Don't tell me this little bitch is your girl. <laughs> Didn't know you were into elementary schoolers. <laughs> That's messed up, man. What the hell did you just say? You wanna say that again? Say it to my face. Come on! Hey, stop it! Buy or whatever. Hey, you can't get on that. You're gonna regret it. You're being super weird right now. Look, shut up and listen. Uh -oh. You can't get on that. I can't, huh? So you can just decide that for me? It's not like... Like you can just tell me what to do. I'm so done with you. Wait, no! God damn it! No! It's just like before. Shit, he's gonna get on it again? Well, if it does derail, then... What, what is he gonna do? So Kisaragi always gets on that train. And the train always crashes. Once she's on, she's basically dead. Is he... How the hell can I make her understand? Is he going to keep time looping this until he can convince her to not get on the train? Is that what's going on? What? Why are you here? This isn't even your train, right? I'm a stalker. What do you think? You're not listening to me, damn it. Because you're not making any sense. What, you just wanted to have the last word? Wait, that's it. This is the same thing as before. You got all mad at me, so I went after you. So, when was this? In the... In the future? The, the past? The future? The, the, the other time? The other timeline? The loop-de-loop? -loop? Well, can't do much now that I'm back here, I guess. You're such a psycho. I don't know if you're just a delinquent or whatever. But I've never liked thugs like you. Oh, yeah? Y yeah. Guess I should have figured. <laughs> no goddamn way. So it's like an explosion. Hey! 
Answer me! <laughs> what is happening? I guess when you put it like that. No, we're back here. Maybe you've got a point. <laughs> I should slow down and think a little. Still though. Uh, hey, are you even listening? I'm back. <laughs> it's happening all over again. Oh god. Wait. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. I think we need more of that. We need more. Okay. Nenji Ugata is a compassionate delinquent with an old-fashioned sense of honor. All the delinquents in town knew of him during middle school thanks to his fighting skills and nerves of steel. His father is an executive of Shikishima Industries. So he grew up a rich kid. Childhood friends with Miwako Sawatari. Sawatari claims that Ogata is not the type to break promises. Train platform. Platform 5 on Kamazumi Station. You can get on Tsutsuji bound and Azami bound trains here. And then something also got updated, but we're going to have to... It's locked behind mystery points. Okay. <gasps> Nenji! Nenji got to experience the same train accident twice. A voice in his head told him to find the key as it began for a third time. I guess when you put it like that, maybe you've got a point. I should slow down and think a little. Still, though. Uh, hey, are you even listening? You're gonna die! We're all gonna die! Uh, I'm back. He's just like, this it's shit again. All over again. <laughs> oh, boy. Weird voice. The reason is that voice. How'd I end up in this mess? Where the hell was I? It was like... I don't know. I feel like I saw it on some UFO show. Like an alien lab or something. It looked just like that. I was... butt naked, too. <laughs> yes, you were. That's what that guy was saying. All this stuff about how I've got to find a key. Are you sure it was no a guy? What the hell he's talking about. But mm -hmm. I gotta find a way out of this crazy loop. And right now, the only clue I got is this key thing. Thank you, Bay. Hey, Kisaragi, you don't have some kind of key handy, right? What does that even mean? I have the key to my house. Is this it? Nah. Probably not. It's probably I mean, like a code. Some house keys. You're acting kind of weird. Yeah, it's well, really getting to I've me. been having a really weird fucking day. I'm already sick of all this shit. But what can I do? Hey, where are you going? Well, look what we got here. Hi, Wajima. Ogata, most yeah, 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 yeah. This guy. What? You think you're better than me? You have a key? <laughs> hey, you guys got this key thing? What key? You got a key, limp dick? What the hell are you talking about? I don't know, man. Just whatever keys you got. I, I had my motorcycle key. But my teacher took it away. Yeah, boo freaking who. I think it's about time we set. You gotta chill out, man. Oh, yeah. Do you think this is funny? Am I a joke to you? No time for this crap. How about we talk this out? How about screw you? Hey! 
Hey. We gotta do something. The kaiju are coming. What? Oh. Really? Where? I mean, like, not yet. They get here after we get on this train. How do you know that? Cause I saw it. I fucking lived it. Uh. Shit, how do I explain? Come on, you're fighting again? Stop that. Hey, stay out of this, idiot. What do we got here? You Shut up. That wouldn't get to me anymore. But hey, I'm still mad. Stop it. <laughs> uh, man, not again. Damn it. What happened to your hair, buddy? The train's already here. I'm gonna go. Hey, hold it! But... I mean, just hang on a sec. wonder what his thing looks like. Okay. I really need you to stay off that train. Okay, seriously, what's going on? I don't even know how to describe it. Just... It's... It'll be really bad. You believe me? Look, they're coming. This train's gonna get derailed. It's gonna be a huge accident, okay? Uh, okay, whatever. My train's about to leave. I'm being serious here! You can talk shit on me if you want, but believe me, just this once. Please, don't get on that train. Come on, how would I know about the kaiju? <sighs> so, what do I do instead? Let's just get out of the station. We gotta get out of here while there's still time. If we can just get outside this place, that's gotta change something. Fuck. Uh, Come on, this way. So we're Shikishima's. I mean, supposedly, I, if this is the same, like, actually, this is, this isn't the same, I don't think this is the same world that got attacked in 2065 because there wouldn't be a 2065 to attack. It would have already been fucked, so this is like a different dimension or a different planet maybe what's wrong and the one in 2065 Sorry, my ankle hurts where let me see probably a sprain get down fuck the question is why is Shikishima Industries attacking these other or this other like why are they attacking why are they attacking their own DNA like creations man look at them how are there so many they destroyed my home during 1985, too. We can't beat ourselves up over shit we can't change. Maybe there's no way out of this, but we'll never know if we don't run. Anyway, come on. We gotta keep going. Surrender! 
Foggy! Damn it. I'm back here. They showed up in the middle of the city. We couldn't make it out in time. Did you find the key? I don't give a shit about your key. <sighs> Who the hell are you? If you can do all this crazy time crap, then... Then save Kisaragi! Tell me Kisaragi. If you want to save her, you need to cooperate with me. I need you to find that key. If you give me its location, then I'll help her. The, the truth? Yes, I promise. Still, even if I was lying, you don't have much choice. All you can do is trust me. So find that key. I feel like that's either a woman or maybe Okino. Unless it's a man's voice that's like so distorted that it doesn't sound like a man's voice anymore. Escape failed. Well, fine then. Fuck you. Okay. Ogata, Ninji Ogata and Tomi Kisaragi left the station to break free from the repeating train accident only to find that the kaiju have already invaded the town. Hmm. 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 Indeed. All right, we're back. We need to find this fucking key. Put it like that. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, the attack. It doesn't matter if we run. We never make it out in time. We only got a couple minutes until they ruin this place. Even if I told someone about this, nobody would believe me. This must be so fucking frustrating. You're acting kind of weird. Hey, where are you going? I'm gonna go beat up some punks. Well. Jeez. Hey. I think it's about time we settled our shit. Uh. No more running. No, we settled this. Hey, come on, you're fighting. Trying to score with this little. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't even get up into space this time. He just Stop went it. straight for it. You didn't keep pissing me off. This wouldn't keep happening. Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> the train's already here. I'm gonna go. No, you ain't. No, you ain't. No, 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 no. Hi. I'm in the way. I'm in the way. Hey. Damn it. What the hell? Just leave her alone. Damn it. Always turns out the same. The train is derailed. And Kizaragi doesn't make it. Did you find the key? No, I didn't find the fucking key! Answer me, Ninji Ogata. Man, I don't goddamn know. Who the hell are you? What's even going on here? You gonna explain any of this shit? Find it, and I'll tell you. If you want to survive, you need to find the key. Time for a do-over. No! <laughs> please! Please! Hey. Stop! Just give me a clue! Is it a physical key? Is it... Is it like? Is it? A, does it look like I a key? Is it? Like that. <laughs> you got a key? You guys got a key? Anybody got a key? I'm looking for a fucking key. Ooh! Isn't that? I feel like I know that guy she's with. Oh, Kino. Who is he? You're the fucking guy Why in the are voice, you aren't you? I, I don't know. No reason. Bitsini. Wait. That's Iori over there. <laughs> what are you hiding from Iori? That's not it. What? 
Don't tell me you like Iori. Hey, it's not like that. <sighs> Juro? Isn't that... Karabe? Hey! I'm still talking to you here. <sighs> okay, so I can't talk to her... Hey! I'm still talking to... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 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 okay. What? What do you want, Tomi? Stop dodging the question. I want a real answer. For real. It's not like that. Then what is it like? What do you care? You're not my girlfriend. Why are you even getting so worked up? <sighs> it's not a big deal. I was just curious. Right. Sheesh. Right. Fancy meeting you here. Usami-chan. Iori, your place isn't this way, right? Where are you going with Okino-kun? I've just got a thing over in Tsutsuji. There's the train. Let's go, Okino-kun. So these three also are getting on the train. Kind of hard to talk to Fuyusaka like this. Hey, Kisaragi. Oh. They got on the train. What do I do? Uh, yep. Hey, that's the wrong train. Jiro! What is she doing here? Who's over here? Nobody. That's weird. I know they got on. It's Chihiro. <gasps> she de-aged! <laughs> Yori turned into a baby! What's wrong? Are you looking for someone? Like you don't know. Sure am, kid. You see a couple school kids uh, about my age? <laughs> a couple school kids? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Is that like magic? Nah. What the hell am I thinking? <laughs> I wasn't expecting that to happen so fucking literally and suddenly. She's just like, what? What are you looking at? Is there something on my face? Okata-kun, did you need something? Huh? Uh, yeah. Okay, look. I know this seems real sketchy. But not as sketchy as you turning into adult. I'm the guy who chased you onto a train here. There's something I gotta know. Do you have some kind of key on you? I mean, not like a regular house key. It's supposed to be kind of special, except I don't really know how. <laughs> what the fuck are you saying? Yeah, this still sounds pretty damn weird, huh? No, it's normal thing to ask a girl. Hey! What is up with, with, what is up with her? What is up with this? Oh my god. Well, at least you're not a child again. Hey, hold on. Why? Why are you looking for something like that? Good question. Man, I don't know how I'd even explain it. <laughs> you're looking for the key? <laughs> you're the one who originally carried it. Young man. You're the voice in the school nurse. Wait, I was just talking to Fuyusaka. You still are! Wait a sec. <laughs> are you Fuyusaka or... Wait, I know you. 
the League of Darkness. The League of Darkness? What? You're one of the bad guys. What? This will only hurt for a moment. What? <laughs> what? She's not a bad guy? Is that why Sekigahara killed her? 1976? <laughs> Playing this late? Should you Baby be out Nenji. here alone, young man? I'm not playing! I'm training! Say, you must be Nenji Ogata-kun, right? How about I walk you back to your house? Uh, you're fishy, lady! <laughs> you talk like the League of Darkness people! They say all that same stuff when they kidnap kids! Oh, okay, he- The League of Darkness? The bad guys from Common Hero, duh! Duh. <laughs> right, kids and their TV. But you know, I think you're the real bad guy here. Eight years from now, you're going to call a bunch of monsters and destroy the world. Am not! I'd never turn to the side of evil! You're still going to do it whether you're good or evil. Sometimes, things just happen. You can't trick me. I'm not Hold gonna it. get kidnapped. Little punk. Oh! <sighs> that was close. I guess I just did a big lap around the block. What do I do? She even had a gun. She tried to shoot me. She really is from the League of Darkness. I gotta tell the police. Don't move. <laughs> You're a bad boy. Am I gonna die? It'll only hurt for a moment. <laughs> I've just implanted you with nanomachines. It'll add on to the program inside you. It's not a huge change. Add on to the program. It's something we'll need to fight back. And now, we can prepare our weapons. The Sentinels. Man, that stinks. Uh, didn't I just get shot? Did you find the key? Okay. I still don't know what's No, I still don't know here. who that voice is. Get a shot made me remember something. She shot me back when I was a kid, too. You were shot. I'm going to need you to explain the situation. I was on the train, and the nurse from my school shot me. There were even other passengers around, too. No, wait. That was definitely Fuyusaka. She was all grown up, but I know that was her. Wait a moment. Slow down. You're talking about trains. Where is this happening? It's the place you keep sending me back to. The train platform. And this happened when I chased Fuyusaka onto her train. <sighs> so you're looking for the key on a train platform? Well, yeah. Wait, you mean... You don't even know where you keep sending me back to? Okay, I see. That means the person with the key is somewhere around there. You just keep looking. Mm. When do I get the explanation? Never! <laughs> uh. Lady of the League. When Ogata was seven years old, he was implanted with nano machines by Morimura while he was training to fight the League of Darkness in an empty lot next to Tokisaka Shrine. This is what allowed them to prepare Sentinels. So I wonder if Morimura is a is um an alien. We'll just call them. And she, she's make, preparing the Sentinels to fight back Shikishima of Earth, who's like attacking or something like that. And when she said he was going to do something bad in 
eight years, does she mean the other him or like the him him? <gasps> okay, nothing else. Nothing else that I can read. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Ninjio got to chase Yori Fuyasaka onto a train and encountered a little girl. She changed her appearance between Fuyasaka and Morimura, which Kazu got to recall a forgotten memory from the past. All right. All right. I guess when you put it like that... I'm back. It's happening. Mm hmm. Hey, where are you going? Can I just go straight this way now? Yep. Oh, Gata kun. What are you doing? She shot me. Hey, chan You trying to pick on Iori now? Please, Kisaragi. Just relax for a sec. What? I'm begging you here. <sighs> so, that League of Darkness version of you. I mean... Okay, what's your connection to that black cat suit lady? League of Darkness? What are you talking about? Damn it, I sound like a total loon. I mean, the key. You told me something like, I used to carry this key, right? Ogata-kun, I'm really not sure I follow. God damn it. I gotta figure out how to say this right. Okay, so you haven't said it yet, but you're going to tell me soon. You know what I'm saying, right? I just want to know what it all means. I really don't know what you're talking about. Man, this shit's so hard to explain. The train's leaving soon. Let's go, Okinokun. Are we not gonna follow this time? Hey, uh, you don't look so good. I've had a rough few train platform times. Kisaragi, you don't... Juro? He got on the train, too. I don't think we need to do anything with Try him again. Run? Maybe I do? You think I'd run from you? Huh? You're fighting a- Stop it! I think I just beat him up for no reason. Okay, well that's cool. The train's already here. I'm gonna go. Okay, are we gonna follow her? Or are we gonna stick around the station again? Damn it! Can't just leave her alone. Wait, no, stay at the station. Why you keep coming? You keep looping back to the station, but then you keep leaving the station via train. Hey! I fucked up. Maybe I didn't. I fucked up. I you... What am I supposed to do now? Hold on. Let me get a see if I can get a clue. Let the first train pass. I'm back. Is that... Hey, where are you? Yo. Fuyusaka. That wasn't some magic trick, right? Um... What do you mean? Anyway, I mean... That kind of...
kind of thing ain't normal, right? It was some trick, yeah? I'm supposed Seriously, to do. You're being really weird. Hey, Kisaragi. Oh. Uh, hi. Hey, it's Shinonome Senpai. You're here too. Shinonome Senpai. Senpai, you don't have some kind of key on you, right? Though I guess it's not really a normal key. Probably. Man, how do I say this? A key? Yeah, a key. Shouldn't we call someone over? Someone like who? Like a station worker? Waste of time. Why is that? It's just gonna throw us back to the beginning. Hey, what's going on with you? Something's up. Do I go after her? Go hey, after her. That's the wrong train. Bye. See you in the next loop. Unless I get the key, then I don't know what's gonna happen. Alright, is she gonna start doing some weird Oh. Is that Ida? Or Goto or somebody? I don't know. Fuck, I don't know. Oh! Oh! Hey! What happened? Sagi Gahara, what are you doing here? Shinono, my senpai. Are you okay? Must have been her symptoms again. Looks like she passed out. This guy too. I know him. It's Sekigahara from back in the ruined city. Why is he with her? Why are they both knocked out? The hell happened here? They got zapped with the magical Something gun. In his hand. <gasps> it was DD you. Four two six. The key. That's some kind of medicine. DD four two six. Label's not telling me much. That's poison. <gasps> what? What do you mean, poison? It was meant to poison the D-forces. They ended up as collateral damage. D-forces? What are you talking about, old man? It sounds like you know about Shinonome-kun's condition. So you should already understand. The symptoms she endures come from that poison. I thought it was Their medicine. Are infected. They're beyond Their sick. nanomachines are infected? But even with all their sacrifices, they cannot stop the D forces attack. The Dimos forces? You keep talking about these D guys. That's all the big mecha kaiju, right? Wajima, he has a, a D growing right out of his forehead. Born in our future, crossing time to destroy us. Okay. It all comes down to 15 teenagers. But there's 13 sentinels! The commanders of the D-forces. The commanders of the D-forces? Ninji Ogatakun. It is a curse. One we cannot escape. No, Miura, Miura doesn't have the curse, though. Miura... Miura's... He's not affected by the curse. Because of his surgery. Where's all this weird shit coming from? Miura's gonna save the world! Who are you? We it shot him anymore. I'm just a man in the past now. But it was never the kaiju. It was never the, the problem, kaiju. The true blot on this world was always the D forces creator. The D forces creator. Mankind was the cancer all along. Well, yeah, duh. Mankind. We all know mankind fucks up everything. I got through. Can you hear me? If you can hear me, 
hear my voice. Then report. <sighs> I found Ryoko Shinonome. When I got on the train, I found her out cold. Sounded like the poison got to her. Poison? A guy named Sekigahara was knocked out too. That got anything to do with your key? I think I get what's going on here. Well, I don't, so can you fill me I in? You don't match up with my information. It's definitely someone else. When you see this key, well, no matter what it looks like, you should know it's the key. I thought I got the key! What's going on in that train? Something's not right there. When I'm inside the train, things always seem messed up. You need to take a closer look. I knew it was you! Oh, gotcha! I mean, Okino! Wait! I know that guy. He was with Fuyusaka. Are we gonna unlock him now? Nope. <clears throat> All right. He's cleared for that part. Woo! It unlocked Hijiyama. Ugh. But is that where we want to go? Look at all these people that I can do. Fuck. 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 Do you guys think... Where do you guys think I should go? Do you guys have any suggestions? Because, like, uh, there's just too many. Like, we haven't done Shinonome's prologue yet. We haven't done Goto's prologue yet. We've only done... Shu's prologue so far, so like he barely, we barely did anything on him, and then uh, same with Hijiyama, and then like everybody else, like fuck. I have to pick, or it doesn't count. I say. Goto. I'm very curious about this guy. He seems to know a lot. Or at least some version of him. Okay, yeah. See, he's in the know. Final battle a few weeks earlier. What do you think you're doing, Goto-kun? I believe I told you using the gate is prohibited. Tell me, Miss Morimura. Is history one of your better subjects? I have some theories myself. I'd like to know if they're accurate. For example, the true location of the lost nation of Yamataikoku. Yamataikoku. And the truth behind the Hanoji incident. How Oda Nobunaga really died. Unfortunately, my paper in middle school was bound to the failures of our historians. In theory, I could update it into a full report. In theory, at least. A shame that the gates are locked to specific points in time. What are you really working towards? It's simple. I want to know the truth. I do too. Let's learn are the truth right? together, Goto. This isn't like you. That implies an understanding of what is like me. <laughs> or at least, that you believe you understand me. That's not the point. You need to stop using the gate. I'm going to seal this place off. So there's a gate here in this um, classroom. <laughs> Sounds like you've got something to hide. I don't know what you're... Wait. Perhaps a personal notebook seems a bit archaic, but it does present certain advantages. Digitized data can be altered, fabricated, falsified. No intelligent person should trust it. But you already know that, don't you? 
as we live in this digital age. You are acting strange, after all. I hardly think you're in a position to talk. If anyone's changed, it's you. I can only wonder why. What are you? Miss Morimura, my question is, who exactly are you? So, did the scout unit have anything for us? Well, the surface is a total loss. The automated factories are all running at full capacity. They're mass-producing kaiju. The hell is this? These weird Terminator things. Hey, getting used to everything? The technology itself isn't so different from 40 years ago. The real surprise was finding that it's all been integrated into one unified system. You sure don't seem like someone from your time. How are things looking? About like we expected. Naturally. All the nuclear plants are stable. Seems like it's the same for other countries, too. Defensive measures. They want to ensure nothing interrupts production. So, these factories, are they particularly large? It's more about how they got totally automated. That was back in 2080. They started functioning as part of a network instead of individual units. A worldwide network comprising 1.2 billion factories. Shit. All fully integrated and synchronized. That's a lot of kaiju being produced. Based on a client's request, the computer designs a blueprint. From there on, everything is fully automated. Assembly, production, even cost-effective ordering of parts. The human element was no longer necessary for those processes. So it's a manufactory that can mass-produce anything on a global scale. It's fucking scary. We checked on the plants in Kolkata and Chennai. Since they're the largest plants of this era and all, their production rate has doubled over the last three days. Just like last time. The timing matches up, too. Not long now. They'll make their move soon. Morimura-san. Regarding my home time, that is, the year 2064, you're certain we'll face a similar attack? We don't have long until they appear in 2064. Yeah, that Natsuno know, saw it. It'll be just like last time. No, not quite. This time, we have the Sentinels. True. I don't think they help, though. Anything on your end? Loosely speaking. We managed a partial data dump from the underground mainframe. Goto-kun? It's an archived news report. Concerning a certain scandal. More important, though, is its date of recording. When's the data from? The year 2188. In other words, far in the future. Even more so than our current temporal position, 2104. Let's see it. Or is it in the past? Hmm? Before dawn on the 20th, eight Newman Inc. executives were taken into police custody. Charged with human trafficking and illegal cloning, their established motive was to tamper with human memories. Authorities consider this an organized effort and are pursuing further charges. Mind hacking crimes have been on the rise in recent years. Mind hacking crimes. By exploiting nanomachines such as interlocitors, malefactors can overwrite stored memory information in cerebral synapses. This technique has recently been used to enable other associated offenses. 
These arrests come after a string of similar cases, including culprits criminally downloading memories onto another body. Evidence suggests these are attempts at a kind of technological reincarnation. And we've already seen more than 460 arrests connected to this practice. They're trying to do what now? Putting memories into other people's bodies? Oh, like Juro. Like Juro? Like Juro! Right? Yeah, so it's like what they... It's like Juro. They, they said that he had, he had to get new memories. Like, they didn't just wipe his memories. They gave him a new... New memories or something like that. Okay, Morimura. Confuse me more! Please. I didn't know it was even possible to download memories. The crime apparently occurred in June of 2188. Itakuna. That's not all. Let him finish. Regarding this Newman, I found one more log that could be relevant. This report is from March, about three months prior to the other log. Okay. Three months prior. Newman Inc., the tech giant known for inner lociters, has been acquired by Shikishima through a takeover bid. Oh, Shikishima, Shikishima took over. The CEO had this to say. Nanotechnology has made leaps and bounds. Is that Okino's pop pop? Century. I mean, Ogata? I keep getting them two names mixed up because they both start with the O. Even the human body can operate with all the power of a supercomputer. Inner Lossiters have paved the way for humanity's next step in evolution. For any one of us, all it takes is a thought. And we can have the world itself at our fingertips. With the brilliant minds at Newman driving our nanotech business, we look forward to a brighter future for Shikishima and all our affiliates. With this acquisition, Shikishima now sits among the top three in global market share of interlocutors. They kept talking about those interlocutors. You think that's the nano machines inside our own bodies? Most likely. So Shikishima's at the heart of this, too. At least we know we weren't wrong. This all began in the future after all. Still, 21. It all began in the future. 2104 is the furthest we can shift into the future. It's a shame, but I don't think we can verify this ourselves. Hmm. I think we should drop this lead for now. Better to focus on protecting Gotokun's hometown instead. Maybe so. We're almost out of time, so we'll need to move quickly. Best to return to the school in the year 2064. We'll need the cooperation of the other two compatibles. Gotokun, we should focus on putting the Sentinels through the combat sims. I hope you can join me. Sure. So Goto's from the 2060s for time. My apologies, Miss Morimura. Making arrangements in 1985 proved somewhat difficult. I'm sorry we've had to remain here the past few days. Not much we can do if it's an emergency. So, like, I guess she can change her age at will maybe or maybe she just I, don't, I mean in the train she could but i don't know why she would be a child here in this destroyed city so maybe like she she's has to be a child in this time for some reason i have to ask was it absolutely necessary to dress me up like this yeah it's cute does it bother you considering the age you appear well it struck me as the most inconspicuous choice. She's like, where's my cats? My, my black leather cat suit. <laughs> the 
You're not having trouble walking, are you, Miss Morimura? You should probably just call me Chihiro. Otherwise, we'll seem suspicious in public. Okay, Chihiro. San. Better drop the San, too. Honestly, I'm surprised you were able to find me at all. A certain data log helped. I found records that your mind had been transferred into the young child standing before me. Hmm. This body is a juvenile clone of me. I ran an experiment to see if I could restore my compatibility. It turned out to be a failure. That's why I sealed my memories. What? Her compatibility with the Sentinel, maybe? She can't... Um, so, I think, like, after you age to a certain point, you, you're you not compatible to fly, the, to uh, pilot the Sentinels anymore. So, the current Morimura it cannot um, pilot anymore. And what else did she just say? This compatibility... That'd be the ability to control the gate and the sentinels? You need compatibility to control the mainframe. I was once compatible myself. But after everything got rewound, I lost that power. Oh, and they Maybe reset it's hard for memories. You to see how crucial that ability is. But you'll understand soon enough. What's going on with my actual body? She's acting like a completely different person. Yuri. My theory is that someone's taken control of her. You're saying she got mind hacked? She's clearly behaving very differently, at least. It seems like she's working against the Sentinel Project. It's like she's been influenced by 426. 426. Or the man himself may just be wearing her face. The man himself. That certainly explains why you woke me up. <sighs> what? Not much to go on, though. Either way, we'll have to do some more investigation. I can see it's been quite a while since my memories were sealed. Five whole years. And now four sectors have gone dark. Talk about a rude awakening. First, you'd better catch me up on major developments in the last five years. Easy enough. Hardly comfortable surroundings for a briefing, though. I'll explain over in 1985. So, maybe a few more weeks earlier, okay? That should do it for preparations. Now, let's see if the biometric authentication works. They said the... Uh, the... Consciousness or the person who's taken over her actual body is working against the Sentinel Project, so... I think it's the the one in the black suit because she seems to be kind of bad like she's against everybody maybe I, I don't think it's the the high schooler Iori because she seems to be not she doesn't seem to know anything that's going on, so I don't feel like she's working against the Sentinel program. I think it's one of the adult Morimoras or something. <sighs> I don't know. No idea. Did it go through? So this is that underground bunker that had like a timer on it. And Izumi and Looks like that got me past the initial barrier at least. Now, okay, no. with Miss Marimura's ID, I should be able to get into her logs. she left behind. 
Today's date is March 2nd, 2100. Well, I guess there's no point in putting a date to these logs. They've probably got four years left until the invasion begins. I ran an experiment on my clone. I wanted to see if I could make her more compatible. I had more than enough data stored in Sector Zero. She would have had all my memories. However, I could not establish compatibility in the clone. No more than I could in myself. Maybe... There really is no way we can survive this. Not even Ida Kun knows about this experiment. I've kept this attempt secret from everyone. The memories I implanted in the clone have been sealed. I left her in 1940 under the Miura family's care. She'll be able to grow up as her own person. Someone separate from me. Until they invade, at least. Hmm. Okay. So that is not Mira's actual sister. He just thinks she is. That methodology sounds familiar. Was she basing this project off of those memory overriding crime reports? All in an effort to achieve compatibility? So compatibility isn't just a matter of differences in the nanomachines. This refers to the humans who can control the UFO's mainframe. Those compatible have nanomachines implanted in their bodies. A log concerning the scandal involving Newman Inc. The report is dated 2188. Some of their executives were taken into police custody. The crime in question was apparently attempting to use nanotechnology to, in theory, mm -hmm. Three months prior to the Newman Inc., Newman was acquired by the conglomerate. She with these inner lociters, they've become one of the world's top megacorp. They all function as part of a unified global Just reviewing all the facts. Network. By its protocols, all 1.2 billion factories and their sole output are these mechanized kaiju. Mm hmm. There's more. This file looks like the last thing recorded. one that stops the loops right operation aegis ever since the battle that ended with the sentinels infected miss morimura has been pushing this operation as one of its fiercest supporters Puzzling. What? What now? There's, There's enough no puzzling shit. Oh, great. As far as I know, I've never recorded It's you from like the this. future. Or your clone, or your. Fucking. Fuck. Renya Goto speaking. Ah! <laughs> what happened, Ren? What happened, Goto? You let yourself go. <laughs> Oh, the glasses. I should have I should have known. Wait, so he okay, so he's the He's the 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 the, the Newman guy? He's the Newman guy? He was he the Newman guy? Did you confirm receipt of payment? And I'm sure you can see to the details. Am I clear? I want her dead. Any means necessary. <gasps> Execute her. Moimura! And stop the project. You got Sigigahara to That's kill her. My problem. Or something, maybe. Now. I don't know. Do you realize what'll happen if her project gets approved? It could ruin everything we worked for. You know what must be done. Kill Chihiro Morimura. Was that really me? 
That man was a Shikishima executive. Oh, Shikishima executive. Okay. Is that supposed to be my future? <sighs> Seems like a private communications log. The other person on the line wasn't recorded. Was it Seki Gahara? It's clear enough what they're talking about. That was an assassination order on Shihiro Morimura. Which I seem to have called in. Dang. Okay, we got a lot. With calm and patience, he brings the Sentinel pilots together, always keeping an eye on their ultimate goal. He acts as a leader to the other students. CEO of the large conglomerate Shikishima. So in 2188, he's uh, he's working for uh, Nenji Ogata. Because he took over, right? Chihiro. She's Chihiro Morimura's clone. Created from the compatibility experiment. Upon birth, her original memories were sealed by Morimura and lives a, lived a normal life as Mira's little sister. However, once Renya Goto saw Mi Morimura's experiment log from March 2nd, 2100, he abducted her from the Miura house and awakened Morimura's sealed memories. Goto is also the one who prepared her kindergartner outfit. So that's why she... That's why when Mira saw them together... She was acting like not his sister because her actual memories got awakened. Terminal. Okay, a terminal self defense system. When the Aegis system is activated, the kaiju won't be able to invade a specific range around it. It takes two minutes for the system to activate. That's why we have two minutes for each battle. Okay. Those with the capacity to control the gates, sentinels. Oh, the compatible. Okay, those with the capacity to control the gates, sentinels, and the mainframe. In an experiment to see if she could transfer her compatibility onto her clone, Morimura used her data, which she had saved in Sector Zero, to create her clone. However, this experiment failed to establish compatibility. Okay, yes. The sentinels were ready for use after the 2104 Kaiju invasion. The first time they were actually used in battle was 2064. So they were first ready for use in 2104, but the first time they were actually used was 2064. Okay. Does that make sense, right? It's still so confusing because it's like, there's... There's different times, but then I think there's also different dimensions and different planets, and I'm just not really sure what the hell is going on, you know? You know? 